Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel where it's my opinion or no opinion at all. Scottalicious McFabulous here and I hope that you are feeling Percy. And today we are going to the Kate Spade Outlet Store to check out all of the latest handbags and handbag collection releases. You can't tell me what to do, you ain't my mother! But before we hop into today's shop with me to Kate Spade Outlet, if you guys love handbags, Kate Spade, luxury, hauls, the whole lot of those, please hit the subscribe button if you are new. And if you guys enjoy today's content, make sure you hit that like button as it does help me know you enjoy today's video. And it helps with that pesky <coughs> YouTube. Al, go, rhythm. Just flush. I'm a dancing granny, just watch the hip hop. Once music starts, I don't want to stop. 70% off of sickening, sickening new styles. That look fairly similar, I might say. But first up, we are looking at the Kerry Small Flap Shoulder Bag with Smooth Quilted Leather. I love this bag. I love how quilted it is. It looks very beautiful. It looks like stunning. something that we know and love from another brand. So it's nice to see an affordable, uh, we'll say a dupe. 70% off, not bad. $529 Canadian. So that's a really good starting price for a brand new bag style. And it felt decent. It didn't feel too cheap. Now, mind you, with like quilted smooth leathers from Kate Spade Outlet, they're not going to be the highest quality, but it didn't feel bad. It was pretty decent for the price. The clip felt nice as well, has some push buttons on the side, and you can wear it crossbody or shoulder bag and it has like four different colors it had the pink the white the white was really nice it has black and then it has the iconic green that they've been using on like all of their handbags which i really like the color again it doesn't feel bad and the stitching looked good as well it lines up nicely, doesn't look like it's all over the place, and it looks really good with my outfit. I think only thing I would complain about is probably the chain used. I'm not a huge fan of those type of curb chains, curve chains, whatever you want to call them. But it wasn't bad. It was a pretty good bag. For the price, I should say at least. Like 70% off 529 not bad. And then here we got the carry mini camera bag with quilting $429 so you can either get this one that's a little bit cheaper or you can spend a little bit more money and get something bigger can it would still fit a fair decent amount though it's not a small small bag it says mini but I'd say it's normal camera bag and then here we have the puffy color block top Handle crossbody. $529, 70% off. I did, I, I, I want to say I like this bag. I like the leather used. It felt like pretty decent, like puffy uh, pillow leather. It was not pillow. It did not feel pillow. It was very stiff. It was very stiff puffed leather, but it didn't feel bad. The only thing is, is that it was really hard to, like, manhandle. I was struggling. It was just one of those bags that are not one-handed friendly, so... That's why I see all those jump cuts. Not bad, though. It looked pretty cute. I like that it's a top handle. I'm just obsessed with top handles right now. Oh. 
And then here we have the carry medium color block, shoulder bag, flap bag, whatever. My God, I wish they would just stick to smaller names. <laughs> but I do like it. I like the larger size better than the smaller size. You're obviously going to fit a bit more. Though it is like $70 more, 599 plus tax. Though that, again, 70% off. You're not paying $600. <laughs> and the size increase is pretty sizable. The color block is fun. It's different. I also like the green. It's a cute bag. I like it. <clears throat> MK Soho vibes. Anybody? That's what I think. That's, as soon as I seen it, that's what I thought. And they even had the carry like, flap in tweed. In tweed. Which was also pretty nice. We all know I like the Kate Spade outlet tweed because it's not too, like, rough or anything. It has, like, that right softness to it. I actually have a tweed bag behind me right now. And I love, I love it. Perfect spring bag. And this is a perfect spring slash summer bag as well. Really beautiful color. And the snap closure works nicely. Not finicky at all. And then quickly looking at the carry small card holder. It even has like a little uh, clip ring. So you can kind of use it as like a bag charm or like whatever you want to use it as. Throw some keys on it. Has a few card slots. Has Kate Spade embossed on the inside. Not bad. I like the quilting. $169. 70% off. Okay. Not bad. Not bad at all. I think that works out to being like $40 or something. And then here we also have the carry a medium compartment bifold wallet. They could have just called it the carry bifold wallet. <laughs> uh, these 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 handbag brands make me want to like cry sometimes. These names are just outrageous. But the wallet is actually really cute. The wallet is really really cute. Has Kate Spade with the embossing on the inside. $239. With 70% off that, if I'm doing like quick, quick math, I think that's like $70, something like that. Which is, that's a, that's a fair price. I'll say that's a fair price. Here we got the carry bucket bag. The quilted carry bucket bag. I don't think the quilting translates well in the bucket bag. As you can see, it just kind of like, distorts the diamonds and it doesn't look as nice as it does on like all the other styles that we just seen. It's cute though. It works, but definitely not for me. $529 as well. It looks like it's a really roomy bag. So there's a plus to it. <laughs> and then here we got 60% off of some beautiful top handle bags. The Regan top handle crossbody bag in that beautiful green. I'm obsessed with the green. We've seen this green float around for Kate Spade for a while and I'm just obsessed with it. Have I bought anything in it? No. <laughs> just usually something else that I want. But the Regan is a pretty cute. It reminds me of one of the... Uh, one of, I think it's the Katie, the Katie top handle from the uh, uh, Kate Spade Retail Boutique. $529 if you didn't see the price there. And then here we have the Regan Pansy Toss with top handle crossbody. Beautiful little flowers, yellow, purple, and blue. Very creative and fun for spring and summer. Mainly spring with those colors. Very Easter. Perfect Easter vibes. <sighs> also $529. So there's nothing significantly, like, there's no price increase. Which is good. Sometimes they like to do that with embossings. And it's cute with my outfit. 
Does it match? Mm. Does it work? Absolutely. <laughs> very, very cute. But I also, I don't like the Kate Spade mirrors. When you get too close, it starts to like double the vision on the camera and I hate it. But then we got the Regan little card flap wallet, whatever it's called, button snap wallet, billfold, bifold, compartmentable zipper wallet, wristlet. Man, the things they'll call the right. This one's a but here we got it and it it's pretty good. And there's quite a few card slots. The leather feels nice. $249, 60% off. Okay. I will say Kate Spade has been really bringing it for the quality and just pure design choices lately. It was, a, it, it was a nice leather. I did notice that. I was playing with it and I was like, oh, this actually feels like a pretty good leather. Like a nice, sturdy, sturdy, good leather. Like this reminds me of something you would find in a Kate Spade retail store. Which only means the Kate Spade retail store must have better things, right? <laughs> Here we have the Regan Pansy Toss small shoulder bag with like wicker. Or some, side of, some sort of like canvas material. Very pretty. It's a very summer. Very cute. $579. 60% off. So this is kind of where things get a little more pricey. But it's cute and it works. It's a really cute piece. And again, the leather wasn't bad. I was pleasantly surprised with Kate Spade Outlet. I mean, I do own a couple Kate Spade Outlet pieces. Like... We know Kate Spade has grown on me quite a bit. But, like, this collection was pushing the envelope, which was nice to see. It's always nice to see brands always push their quotas. Like, push the quality department to their limits. Really push for things that make the customer excited. I like noticing these things. And as you can tell, there's a nice little size difference between the wallet and the shoulder bag. Love the shoulder bag. Very cute. And beside it, it has the white, I believe. I believe. I'm so colorblind, girl. I believe it's white. Pale MF? I don't know what that means. Is it blue? Maybe it's light blue. I think that was like very pale blue. Here we got one of my favorites. The Wild Petal Birdhouse Crossbody. This is so cute. Their novelty bags are just the dopest. Like, I'm so sad I missed out on the gingerbread house. I was hoping it would hit clearance, but it didn't. $559. I believe these are only 50% off. So you generally have to pay that premium price for these novelty pieces because they just sell out. They just sell out. And with how cute this one is, I guarantee you it'll go as well. It has a nice beautiful bird bag charm and this is just even if you only use it once a year or never it is a great looking piece like it's a nice um house decoration it's a beautiful spring decoration piece for your house or your office literally anything it's really really cute And then here we got some Darcy Small Satchels. Buy two for $179. Get the long wallet there with the bag for $179 bucks plus tax Canadian. Not a bad deal. Here we got this small Darcy Satchel in the nice navy blue leather. Got the pansy toss print. Leather's a bit thin, but that's to be expected with certain Kate Spade outlet bags. Not bad though. I, I wasn't unimpressed. I was like, okay, I see you. I see you, Miss Darcy Small Satchel. I see you. And I do really like this color here. 
But again, with those cross green leathers, I'm just, I'm not a huge fan of those. But the color's cute. $429. Um, $179. I, I don't know the exact math for that. It might be like 70% off or something. But it's cute. I like it. Nice, easy carry-all for everyday use. Looks really cute with my outfit, too. Matches all the browns and the tans in my perfectly curated outfit. Bam. Looking fierce. Would I buy this bag for myself? No. But it is cute. Here we have the Dana Tote. $139 to grab the Dana Tote or buy it for $109 or something like that. I don't know. But uh, $139, you get the matching wallet with your little tote bag here. They all have the beautiful flower hang charm there. $429 originally. On the Kate Spade Outlet website, it does say they're $109, but that is American. So I don't know the exact price for the tote itself if you don't want the wallet. But for $139, you might as well grab the wallet with the bag. It says the wallet is $209. That's also called the Dana. So you get the matching Dana wallet with your Dana tote bag. Not too shabby. And then lastly, we're going to look at the Dana tote bag with the pansy toss print. I did think these flowers are a little finicky, so I don't know if that's just like a bag design or like charm design, but cute prints. $4.29 as well, so there's no price increase. Has a nice white lining. Not bad for a door crusher. And 99, don't believe in you. But all you need is just for one person to believe. There can be a hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred, hundred people, hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred people, hundred, 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 or a thousand, nine thousand, or nine nine hundred ninety nine. There can be a hundred people in the room. Alrighty, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's Kate Spade outlet shop with me for these stunning new pieces. I love that Carrie satchel or the Carrie small smooth quilted leather crossbody shoulder bag satchel top handle blah 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 whatever they want to call it. It's stunning. I really like it. Would I buy one? I have such a large handbag collection and like I said, the carry reminds me of something. It reminds me of the MK Soho. So I do feel like that's a really good dupe to get if you don't want to pay like full price for an MK Soho. Anyways, if you guys did enjoy today's Kate Spade outlet shop with me, make sure you hit the subscribe button. If you are new, hit that like button, share with your friends and family, comment to me any type of opinion you may or may not have had on today's outfit of the day or shop with me to Kate Spade. As well, you can support me and the channel directly by sending me a very generous super thanks donation. And you can check out the description box below for the three lucky links to my Instagram, Facebook and Discord notification squad. I love you all to the absolute moon and back and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye! <laughs>